Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with my February 2019 wax empties. Um, this is going to be a very, very quick video. I barely went through anything last month. Um, it's because I was doing the all the Walmart reviews, the warm review scents, and there was a lot this year. So that took a couple weeks. Um, so I apologize. I I kind of like just did the Walmart wax reviews and you know tried to warm through all that and everything and successfully did it, did it. so <laughs> I wasn't able to melt a lot of wax uh, while doing the reviews obviously so let's just get into this um, like I said this is gonna be a very quick video all right first thing I'm gonna start off with is the hand soap from Bath and Body Works. This is Winter Candy Apple. I absolutely love this scent. It's so good. It lasts so long on the hand, like on the hands, the scent. And it's just a very nice, sweet, crisp apple scent. And I love it. Super, super good. All right. Next up we have from uh, Villainous Wax. This is Reindeer Are Better Than People. This was so good. I used it. I know it's February, but it's still cold here. Um, it's in the, like, 20s, you know, teens. We got into the negatives again for the wind chill. Hopefully it will start to warm up a bit. Um, but anyway, I decided to melt this one because it is still cold, and this was so good. The pine... It's, oh gosh, I want more of this scent. It's such a perfect Christmassy winter scent. It's very strong in the pine, but it's it's a really good blend of like the spices and the ginger and everything else. It's really good. I highly recommend this one. Next up, we have Sweet Patchouli Blue Sugar. This was amazing. One of my favorites from her. Um, this blended so well. It was very sweet, a little bit incense-y type, but the blue sugar definitely blends well with patchouli, so I highly recommend that scent. I would get that again. Next up, we have Magic and Mischief. This one is Sandalwood and Vanilla Bee Noel. This was really good. It was stronger on the Vanilla Bee Noel. That's mainly what I smelled, but it was, it was a nice blend. I wouldn't get it again, though. Not my favorite. Next up, we have is... Freak Show, and I believe this one was lemon tea and something else. I can't remember, but oh, it's so good. It was so strong. Um, this one will knock you out. If you want a nice lemon tea scent, I can't remember what the other note is, but this one is really, really good if you're looking for like a lemony type scent. Yeah, it smells like lemon iced tea, and I love it so much. It's so strong. We have Pacific Playland, Sweetgrass, Pink Sugar, and Mallow. I barely smelled this. I didn't smell any grassy note in here. Um, it was just a very sweet scent. I wouldn't get it again. It was kind of light. Okay, we have Salty Sea Air, Strawberry Frosting, Funnel Cake, Coconut Cream Pie. This one was really good. Um, it was stronger on the Salty Sea Air. It wasn't the strongest scent that she has, but this one was nice. Um, I wouldn't get it again because I like other Salty Sea Air blends, um, but either way. Next up, we have Amity Island Bonfire Pineapple Coconut. I did not like this at all. The coconut in here smells very, very artificial to me. Sometimes coconut smells good, other times it smells very waxy and plasticky to my nose, and that is the kind of coconut I got in here. I wouldn't recommend that. Um, me, personally, I wouldn't recommend it. I, I I, just didn't like it. This one is, I know what you did last summer, Twilight Woods, pineapple, melon, and apricot, or apricot, whatever. <laughs> this one was really, really nice. It's such a pretty scent. This is something I would get in like a perfume from her. The Twilight Woods was definitely the strongest. That is a powerful scent. And this one threw very well for me. Next up we have Orange Sherbet Vanilla Sugar Waffle Cone Funnel Cake from Wolf Wicks. This one did not do so well. The Orange Sherbet to me smells like tang, but this one was very, very light. You have to melt this in a very, very small room, maybe a bathroom, something very small um, because you won't get that much scent throw from there. 
All right, front porch, we have fr uh, red velvet cake. This one I am melting now and it smells amazing. It smells like red velvet cake, so good, very strong, highly recommend, I love this scent. Next up, we have Marshmallow Madness from Ava's Country Covered. This one was okay, it was kind of light. Um, I would not buy this again. I don't know why I bought this because it's marshmallow. Like, I was thinking maybe I should blend it with something, but I melted it on its own and it, it didn't do well. Next up, we have Peppermint Patty from the Bunny Sisters. This one was so good. I would get this one again and again. It smells like a peppermint patty, like dark chocolate and peppermint, and her peppermint is amazing. So yes, and this threw very well, so I'm happy about that. And last but not least, yes, this is the last one. I told you guys I failed so bad in February. I don't even have, I didn't even go through barely any of my picks um, the last pick video, I still have most of that left. So I'm not going to have a picks video until I finish that box. That is my mission. I need to melt through wax. Like I just have so much. It's crazy, but I keep buying. Um, I haven't actually bought anything in a while. I do have, um, a wax haul video coming up soon probably two wax haul videos uh so look out for those but they won't be for a couple days because i'm still waiting on them all right this one is super tart once upon a time melt in bell and this is beauty and the beast which is magically delicious blackberry combined with tea and cakes this one i absolutely loved my friend um gave this to me and it smells so good i didn't like this at first when i first bought it a while ago i think this was like two years ago and I didn't care for it, so I de-stashed it, and then I got it from her not too long ago, and I fell in love with it again. So it's really, really good. The teen cakes are the prominent note, and then I get the blackberry, but love this scent. Really, really strong throw. You only need one cube. The sucker throws crazy strong. And... That is all for my February 2019 wax empties. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I didn't melt much, but hopefully March will be better. I am going out of town at the end of March to the beginning of April, so I won't be melting where I'm going, um, and I apologize. So I'm going to try to have some videos for you guys so I can upload. If if I can't do that, I apologize, but... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going on a little vacation at the end of this month. So, well-deserved, that's for sure. Um, definitely work hard. Okay, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. That is all. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button. If you're new, subscribe. I'd love to have you here. And hit that little notification bell down below. It will notify you when I upload next. Um, alrighty, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!